and welcome to uh, Vingroth's Siege Mage Adventures. Um, my chroma key's a bit off for some reason. And uh, let me fix my mic <laughs> first off. And what the heck happened to my chroma key? <laughs> it like sometimes it changes right before the stream. Let me just check that out. It's not too bad, but still, it would bother me. Just a little bit more. Well, now my shoulders are starting to disappear, so that's never a good thing. Not some of this. A little bit less of this. Oh gosh, that didn't work. <laughs> more of this, less of this. You have to, like, blend everything. <laughs> hey, Conboy, how's it going? <laughs> oh my goodness. What is going on? My shoulders are really glitchy. Hey, wait, let me just do this. I'm gonna take a new... Oh, that's us see. Sometimes you just gotta take a new color. That's much better. Sweet. Alright, cool. So, we're ready to go. Um, so, I'm not exactly where I was all left off. I was, uh, I just dropped off some, or I sold some things. Uh, which is cool. Hey, Phantom. So, I still couldn't find anybody who could buy base necklace of the sea which is fantastically expensive hey Jadis, how's it going um but yeah we um i haven't been able to sell those but i sold like there was like an enchanted weapon and an enchanted shield and some other stuff like that so uh, yeah so right now i'm in the tower because i realized i can level up <laughs> so why don't we do that at, uh when we start off right sweet um, alright, so I always bring up intelligence to increase our magicka. Agility just to increase the damage with bows. Normally I would do speed, but now that we have endurance, um, I think, I think I'd like to have a bit more fatigue, and also a little bit more health. Because <laughs> my character's not tanky, but he certainly needs what he can get. Um... I don't even know how I increased this. Governs the level of... I guess I used armor. <laughs> but I will take the uh, extra health. <laughs> yeah. Been looking forward to this out. <laughs> nice, Silver Vein. Alright. Sweet. Alright, so we're ready to go. I did make a few potions. Um, I had some flax and some other stuff lying around. So I've got like nine restore magicka potions for today's adventure. Um, but yeah, everything's good. Uh, no new mods today, but I am looking at a few. Um, I'm looking at <clears throat> retexturing the lightning spell, because lightning spells in this game are like five things of lightning and it's really distracting. I kind of like just the single bolt of lightning. I don't know. Um, also, pro like, spell projectile speed and somehow rebalancing, um, the mercantile skill. Because I feel like you should actually gain more, like, mercantile or mercantile, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, when you, um, when you sell something, like, really big for, like, a lot of money. Um, in Oblivion, it's more like every purchase increases, or, no, every purchase, every, every item sold increases by, like, 0.4. Which is kind of weird, so I'm gonna look for some weird rebalancing thing to help us out there. Oh gosh, of course I've come upon some angry Khajiits. Barely even like walked out of the place yet. But she is, she's doing well. Oh, missed him. Oh. Sweet. Already starting off with a bang. There we go. Um, I guess I'll take the fur curious. Lock pick. Old two handed beard axe. That's wild. Um, I'll take the other one. More potions of healing. And she had a weird weapon too. In the immersive um, weapons pack. Don't know where it is though. 
It's weird, usually like in Skyrim or something it would actually have like the weapon in their inventory even though like it could have been blown like halfway across the room. Um, it makes finding this item a bit more difficult. How come I can't lift her up? It's weird. Is it this? Boken? It's a Boken. I tried to stream for two hours. Oh, uh, yeah. Convoy, you know, I, I had that issue too. <laughs> hey, Derek Extreme. Well, Boken is a very interesting thing. Is it worth anything? No, not really. We'll just, we'll just drop it then. There we go. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, get some of these. These are Storm Magica. Those are super useful. Yes, I did work that weird. <laughs> this isn't the place you come for grammar lessons, definitely not. <laughs> what is... Okay, we'll probably go to that later. Let's not get distracted by everything I see off the road. Let's at least, you know, try to complete these Mage's Guild quests so I can actually uh, do the main quest. How about that one? No, I haven't. I've seen um I've seen different things on YouTube, but no, I haven't I haven't seen any of this war of mine. I'll have to take a look at it. Well, like honestly, like I barely play video games aside from streaming. <laughs> like really like like I don't have much time during the day. Um, and the only other, t you know, spared time is either fixing or modding whatever game I'm playing on stream. I think I can take care of this guy pretty easily. Yeah, you know, it, it was it was pretty tough. Like starting off streaming is is pretty weird. Um, yeah, it, it, it's weird because you know a couple of things. Like right, sometimes the internet like connection's not great. You know, either you know from your end or from Twitch's end. So you might actually have viewers, but you don't even know. Uh, when I started off streaming, it was it was very awkward. And um, what I did was I basically like played for the video or for the vod afterwards. You know, at least pretend that there's people there. Um, <laughs> that's that's how I started off. Um, and then eventually I started getting more comments and more people. And uh, that's that's just how it went. Oh hey, hillbilly cat, how's it going? <laughs> More used to I know what you mean, Derg. I know what you mean. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I think trolls are weak to fire, but oh my gosh, he's fast. I think they regenerate too. Atronach, you need to get over here. Whoa. Oh gosh, he's regenerating health really quickly. <clears throat> Please do melee. No. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I'm doing good today. Marksman skill increased. Holy crap, I was not expecting a troll in the middle of nowhere. Let me, um... <clears throat> Two <laughs> more Vingroths. <laughs> I guess. I guess that works, right? I'm not sure how I'd clone myself. Let's just restore with a Wakeland Stone. Whoa! My Wakeland Stone didn't restore all my Magicka. Boars are a pain. Yeah, that's true. I remember that. We need to clone him. <laughs> yeah, if I had a clone, I'd like stream like like every two hours and just switch off and it would be the same guy but in a different shirt. 
seems like an interesting premise. <laughs> Who googled it? <laughs> nice. There are ways. Um. Oh yeah, I wanted to look at my level of Magicka. So, does a Wakeling Stone only restore like 385? It's kind of weird. <laughs> I don't have any brothers or twins to train, no. Um, and my dad works. Um, so no, I can't get my dad to do it either. He would stream, but... Um, I mean, he's been on my stream before. But I... I don't know what he would play, to be honest. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could try to get him to play Oblivion. He liked playing it, like, when it first came out. Oh, gosh. Yeah, when it comes to annoying enemies... Okay, that's a butterfly. I was worried a second. I thought it was, like, some sort of, like, a bow or some object just but going, like, crazy like that. <laughs> You went from a red shirt to a green shirt, like Shaggy. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, we're going close to Breville, which is nice. There was some stuff along the way, but I wasn't gonna bother. Is this night? Ooh, nightshade. We need nightshade for different poisons. Get an apprentice and teach him your ways. Sounds like a plan. Yeah, when it comes to annoying enemies, gosh, will the wisps are awful. Um, I think I really didn't like mountain lions. Oh, he's looting that wolf. Oh, now he wants to loot me. <clears throat> Ow. How dare you. Oh yeah, let's just pelt him with fireballs. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. <laughs> yes. All the fire. Actually, I think he's a Dark Elf, so he's kind of resistant. But that was pretty sweet. I enjoyed that. He's an Iron Tonto. I guess I'll take that. <laughs> yeah, now he wants to loot me. <laughs> uh, Worn Shortbow. Ooh. This is, um... Oh, that's interesting. Oh, I've got... Oh, gosh. I've got an arrow through the... Through the... Through the palm. And three arrows. Like... Uh, I don't know where that would be. Like, my lower intestines? <laughs> that's nasty. <laughs> Good thing they just fade away after a while. It's no big deal. <laughs> yeah. I know, I feel like I feel like my character should have like shouted in pain. Uh-oh. <laughs> ah! That's a wolf! <laughs> that scared me! <laughs> oh man, I was not expecting that. I will pepper you with arrows. Go. Burn! There we go. Yeah. Actually, it was really funny. Some of the, like, you've been, like, you've been hit and you're in pain, um, like, audio files were really funny in Morrowind. Like, if you were a Nord, you'd go, Arr! And, like, um, gosh. I can't remember which one, but it was, like, a female... Like a female Bosmer or like a female High Elf, like if you hit them they go ah! <laughs> It was awesome. No, sorry Convoy. Here wait, let me add that. I have like a list of mods that I need to add. Let me add um Wolf Cry Replacer. <laughs> if that's a thing. It should be though. I just have a little notepad off screen. I jot little notes down from time to time. Um, yes. Uh oh. Oh, it's an imp. Whoa! How dare you! Oh gosh, there's many of them. Go, my A trap. Go.
at that trunk line? Huh. I'll look it up. I still think the idea of a drunk wizard is a terrible idea. No one with arcane energies should ever be on, like, drugs or alcohol at all. Oh, you got him, sweet. The Skuma Diaper Adventure. <laughs> yes, that sounds like a plan. Alright. Good thing these alien wells are around. Thank goodness. Um, so I'm not exactly sure which one of these is better. Um, because the damage is four. Um, this weighs more. I can't really tell, really. That's weird. I mean, the worn short bow looks kind of dumb. It's very short. Um, I kind of like the steel long bow look a little better. Um, I don't know though. Maybe other ones have different benefits. Who knows? Right, so I have to check this place out since I already found it. some imps. I don't know if I should start combat up here. I could, I guess, but... Let's... Ooh, ooh. Yeah, sure, let's do it. Ooh. And summon the h -knot. Oh, can you not shoot over the... the uh... She can't. Great. Oh yeah, definitely. We'll have to do a little bit more with um, the Midas Magic mod. I was trying to look because I did buy um, a second book and it adds a summons. Um, or it, you know, tells you how to make summons, but um, some of them are, are a little bit like higher level, unfortunately. I would have to get some really weird stuff. Ooh. Ow, that hit me. I do want to restore my, or do want to bring up my restoration. Unfortunately, I haven't been using it as much, because it, you know, uses magic. I may incorporate it into a spell, though, that maybe, I don't know, heals me and does a destruction spell at the same time, who knows. I'll have to figure it out. Yeah, the lock ping in this game is a bit weird. I feel like this is one of those things where I have to run to the button, or else I'm gonna take like tremendous damage. Because of the weird gas. Or it opens a door, never mind. <laughs> Ooh. A Varla stone. I think Farless Stones completely, like, recharge, um, the enchantments on items. <laughs> oh my gosh. A Rune Skull. Oh, you always did auto-try, that's pretty funny. So we got a Dwarven Shield. Let's see what this does. Oh my. That's fantastic. Um, if you're wondering, this is a mod called Rune Skulls. Um, it's supposed to be played um, with some other like overhauls that make the game a little bit more difficult. Um, so it seems OP now, but later in the game, it'll be perfectly reasonable. Um, basically, I'm just like holding on to these, like 
just for late game stuff. But it's cool to find one. Plus it gives me an extra like incentive to explore. Cause really, Oblivion doesn't have like an incredible incentive to explore, because everything's like, you know, I'm just gonna get level five items, right? If I'm level five. Alright, let's try to use some magic on this guy. Oh, got him. Sweet. Basically, the rune skulls work the same way a, um... Base ring of snake. Sweet. They work the same way a, a sigil stone would. So the, uh, positive effects would, um... would attach themselves permanently to a weapon. <laughs> I should rename... Well, actually, Convoy, I think, partially... Um, it's because I increased my luck in the beginning. Um, I chose intelligence and luck as my, uh, as my major attributes. So, I mean, we could, we could go nuts and just keep adding to luck like every level. But I feel like at some point, my luck would be overpowered. Yeah, exactly, Dreadmaster. Yeah, exactly, yeah. So that would actually give me, you know, yeah, a one one health regen per second. Um, oh gosh. I feel like it's a little bit too early to be using that sort of powerful item, though. I mean, I don't even know if there's an artifact in Oblivion that actually does that. So I'll hold off on that for now, but keep it safe. That would give me two damage per second. Wait, which one? The rune skull? Let me check it out. Oh, no, see, the negative effects at the top, those would be for weapons. So, my bow would get the um, damage, health, and absorb strength. Everything else, that all that restore health, fortify blade, blunt, and marksman, that would all apply to anything that's a ring. Uh, but good spot there. Yeah. Oh, do we have two Varla stones? How did that happen? I only picked up one? Uh, shoes, it's even more fun on the computer. Um, because you get to add crazy mods, and modding makes everything fantastic. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh, this was a trap. This was a trap. <laughs> Crap. Um, I have some health potions. Oh gosh. Oh. Ow. Let me out of here. I think I got him. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's okay, shoes. Yeah. I got him right in the belly button. <laughs> Ooh, base ring of the north. Fantastic. Let me put that on, because I'm very weak to, um, to frost. Not very weak, but how weak am I, actually? 25, so it's a little better. Alright. I think... Okay, let me check the minimap. Oh, there's... Is there a second place? The inner chambers? Let's check those out. Fair. Yeah, I know what you mean. Um, it's... Oh. 
Oh, you know what? I think there's a second floor. Let me try to get to that. I know what you mean. Oblivion does sort of have a smaller mod pool, but <laughs> if you're comparing it to Skyrim, that's kind of unfair. <laughs> I mean, Skyrim has so many mods, it's ridiculous. I mean, put it this way. There are YouTubers <coughs> who solely do Skyrim modding. Like, that's intense. That you can base, like, an entire channel off of modding a game. I'm gonna switch up my playstyle a bit. Um, if a creature sees me, I'm gonna try to sneak attack it with a bow. Uh, but if it does see me, I'm going to try to use destruction. Use a little bit less summons from now on. Um, until we find a better option, really. It just uses up way too much magicka for me right now. Oh yeah, yeah, I watch MXR all the time, yeah. Yeah, yeah, there's, there's really good fault in Vegas mods too, that's really true. Oops, wrong spell. Well, <laughs> gosh, yeah, Dreadmaster, if you're talking about like a modding community that took a major hit, talk about Morrowind. Holy crap. One of their like major websites, Planet Elder Scrolls, went down, and basically like a whole section of modding history just disappeared from existence. The only reason I had some of my old mods was because I even kept the files. I had like the forethought when I was eleven to save them on a CD of all things. Remember those? <laughs> I know, yeah, Dreadmaster, I know what you mean. That is, it, it, It's so true. Yeah, Oblivion Modding was just basically made to make people more attractive, because holy crap, could you not mess it up more? Like, everybody was creepy in Oblivion. Everybody. Okay, I feel like there's a couple weird things going on. Uh, Combo, are you talking about the, um, the Oblivion mods? Or are you talking about, like, my past Morrowind mods? Because if it's my Morrowind mods, there are some that you, that I've listed that you actually cannot get anymore. Um, Oblivion mods, most of them, oh my gosh, you're kidding me. Well, all right then. Um, if you're talking about um, more mods, do I do this? Skyrim. Yes, yes, I did watch that one. That was pretty good. But yeah, um, what is this? Oh my gosh! Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna actually gonna uninstall this mod um, for the time being. I love this mod. Don't get me wrong. But there's a certain point where they're just throwing themselves at me. And I just want to enjoy the game and not be overpowered in the beginning. Like, the whole idea is to, you know, have a challenge. Um, so, let me just do this very quickly. I'm, I'm act I, lo I love the mod, but we're going we're gonna to install it later. Because <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is absolutely ridiculous. Alright, so just open it up. <laughs> I've had to do this one other time on stream, but it wasn't because I was being overpowered, it was because the uh, mod actually crashed, but here we are. <laughs> oh my. Okay, so move rune skulls. I mean, I guess I could turn up the difficulty, but... I feel like it's just too overpowered right now. Um, we could put it in maybe like when I'm level 30 or something. I don't know. Where is Rune Skulls? It should be really easy to see because it should be, you know, alphabetical order. Yep, here we go. Bam. Alright, cool. <laughs> now that mod isn't in there, but I'm looking forward to turning it on soon.
Well, not soon, but when it becomes easier. I could always just not use them, but I don't know. I seem to be collecting a lot of them, and it seems really unfair. Plus, if I'm getting rune skulls right, what am I missing out on? Oh, okay, shoes. Awesome. Yeah, enjoy your night, too. Um, but yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, Leo Fire, how's it going? So, yeah. Now that's not there. Um, let me just check one thing. Um, okay, so my wizard slippers are still wizard slippers, so... Actually, you know what? Let's get rid of this, too. Let's be honest. Yeah, we'll just leave those here. Yeah, save 1,000. Yeah, yeah, or 3,154, I know, right? Hmm, cool. But yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna get rid of that for now. <laughs> I have more carry weight now, which is pretty cool. Because uh, I'm not wearing those shoes, but... No, I'm not even gonna sell it. I'm, I'm really not. It's just, it's too much in this beginning. You know what I mean? If I should enjoy the game, I should enjoy it. Like, you know. They're, it's basically throwing stuff at me. I can't just do that. That's really weird. Um, let's do a weak potion of sorcery. Do I have a potion of sorcery? No. But I restore magic potion. There we go. Healing. No, I never did play um something called Empire Universe. Um, yeah. I mean, I have a list of games down below. Oh God, there's a troll. Um, do I have any poisons? I have Drain Strength and Damage Health. Let's do a Damage Health. Get rid of that regeneration. Oh, he sees me. Nice! He had a Pewter Spoon. Oh, oh, more Oblivion. Um, I didn't have, uh, much time to mod today, unfortunately. Um, I had a few things in mind, but, um, here, let me add that to the list, actually, since, since you're on the topic. Let's see. Oblivion. There we go. It's added to my list of things down there. Oh, gosh, what do we have here? Wow. Four gold. I know, a complete HD remake of Morrowind would be fantastic. I mean, the graphic sound and overhaul is pretty awesome, but... You know, I'm starting to think maybe I should have kept the rune skulls, because opening, you know, that last chest in there was very disappointing. Actually, thinking about it, that probably had another rune skull. Unless the loot system's just freaking terrible. But I'm just going to assume for now that that was probably another rune skull that despawned because I actually got rid of the mod. Because I was getting way too many. We'll stick with that for now. <laughs> Ease my conscience. Oh, 
All right, we're here. Sweet. Greetings. There's a horse on the bridge. Guards. How could Good you let see. this happen? How? Wait a second. Okay, I can't push him off. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, there's a few more in, in like related projects going on right now. Which pretty cool. Oh, you know what I heard? I heard the lucky old lady gives you like a blessing, and it helps people born on the Atronach. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh gosh, that's great. Now, I'll have to look at, um, let me, here, that's another thing I have to add to a list of mods I need to look at, is improved, like, loot system. Here, let's put it this way. Um, <laughs> the next temple we go to, if I don't get, like, a cool enchanted item from it, at least, we're bringing back the skulls. <laughs> like, that's just, that's just how I'm gonna run it. Um, that and or bringing in, like, some improved loot system that doesn't make you, like, open an average lock to get four gold. Bethesda, I'm watching you. Why you do this Good to me? Good morning. How do you do? We're all talking about the Emperor's murder. Oh, it actually we have no Emperor oh, interesting. and no heir. That's now, never happened I am on the lookout for a, um, for a companion mod, so there's a few, um, or a companion, um, uh, just a companion, I guess. Good day. Alright, now, so, s let me look at your stats. I'm looking for a Nightblade in particular. So, you're level 5. You have Magicka. Combat skills. Alright, so you, like, Blade, Marksman, nah. Not Marksman, I want someone that runs into combat. Well, I mean, those shoes were made by the skull. Hello, associate. Um, so, yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> See you later, Shedmaster. Good luck with your bandwidth. What can I do? Okay, what do you do? I think she's all magic. Her combat skills probably are not that great. Yeah, she's a mage. Mage, magic... Interesting. So no. None of that. I need like a like I don't know, someone that's like beefy that can run into battle and maybe use a couple spells. Alright. Well that's weird. Is there like no one else here besides like partners and Yeah, you're like the leader of the guild. Um weird. Let me try to find some other people, see what spells we can buy. I don't know what cl what school of magic this um this guild does. Delphin Gend, creator of the celebrated Enemies Explode spell. Really? Advanced trainer in destruction. And mage destined for great things. Um What do you sell spells? Take care. Arieri, your friendly guild alchemist. Satisfaction. I think they need to get downstairs Goodbye. first. Maybe. Excuse me. Get all rune skulls, use telekinesis. To, to fire skulls at people. Oh, there's there's it's gonna be followers everywhere. I, there's basically like over 75 and then I added like a lot more. Do you have a silver battle axe? It's wild. Here, let me wait like an hour and see if everybody gets downstairs. Hello. There we go. Oh my gosh. What is everybody Hi. doing? Well met. People are training and stuff. This is wild. Goodbye. Hello there. Are you gonna sell me it's the enemies clip. explode spell now? Yes. Have a look at my wares. I'm sure there's something to see. Ooh. Ooh. That's lovely. <laughs> uh can't use it yet though. Ooh, and there's a better defend. Ooh, that's good. 
Uh, what's the Magicka cost? 35 is not bad. 35 is not bad at all. Um, I have like 5 right now, which is pathetic. Um, heal Major Wounds, I could use that too. Well, that, that's a lot of magic for that. I'm not exactly sure what this, this school of magic is. There's like illusion, mysticism, like fire? I don't, I don't understand this place. Hey, Andrakos, how's it going? Um, I will definitely get the defend, because I'm in need of that one. I should have haggled. Crap. Thank you for your business. You got too. away with murder, lady. <laughs> you got away with murder. Alright, let's get... Let's, yeah, defend. There we go. <laughs> You're playing the same game while watching. That's cool. There we go. Defend. Sweet. Um... You know, it is, it is literally the toughest thing for me to pick my favorite um, Elder Scrolls. Um, it's really weird. Ease Burden is useful too. Ooh, let me check that out. I hope I can help. Have a look around. You won't find better prices in all Oh my gosh! Time. It's really reasonable! Like, Conjuration, like, you spend, like, what, 91 just to have a dude follow you for 30, 30 seconds? Holy crap! 50 points for 240 seconds and it's only 29. Yes? Wait, wait, no. No. Lady, we've been over this. We have to reevaluate this. Oh, okay. I'm on only next. quality. No, no, no. I'm getting that spell for a lot less. Thank you very much. Ooh, that worked. Yeah, that's a fantastic spell. I didn't know why I didn't get that. Is there any in, like open average lock I can get? I don't think I can cast it yet, but whatever. Thank you. All right. Sweet. Good day. But yeah, it's very tough for me to pick like a favorite Elder Scrolls. Um, I really, really like Morrowind. Um, and I like Skyrim and I like Oblivion, but for different reasons. It's, it's, it's they all, have, they all have their, their like shining points. Um, and they're all like wrapped in nostalgia well, bias, yeah. so I can't really give anybody a really straight I answer. Saying. Um, let's see. I can scroll the fall again. <laughs> yeah, Sulfur Bane, no problem. Um, I just magic lol. Yeah, 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 Honky Tonk Pancake, yeah. We have, um, we have one, uh, spell, and it's, uh, what? Midas. What is it? Midas Summon Chest. How are you? Around here, that was my, let me check my I can't connection. Stand those things. Well, seems I okay. Stand the sight I don't have any dropped creatures. frames. Hmm. Alright, but I do have a summon chest in case I am over encumbered, which is pretty cool. Um, let's see. Let's do a quest, right? Hello there, associate. You're here for a recommendation, I presume. <laughs> are you prepared to earn it? Uh, I am ready. I'm afraid I haven't had time to prepare anything conventional. I'm very preoccupied with this situation concerning Ardalin. Perhaps you can help with that, however. I can't directly get involved for fear of embarrassing the poor girl. I'll need you to have a little chat with Varen Vamori, and you can learn something about the power of illusion in the process. Oh, so this place of illusion magic. All right. Recommendation. Are you so eager to begin? Yeah. Very well. We can start if you feel you are ready. I'm ready. I'm afraid I haven't had time to prepare what? anything convenient. Perhaps you can help with that. I'll need you to have a little... Oh, I have to chat with him first. Gotcha. Please, I'm in desperate need of help. Yes, yes, I know you have that other quest that's very pressing, but no. Right now, I need to get some spells. What is it? So yeah, sleeping on ice. It is a fantastic show. 
I hear the manga's Morning. better. Morning. But of course, I'm not like that wrapped in that I actually read manga. I probably should, but. Let's see. Where's this Varen Vimori? How do you do? Oh, there she he is. She doesn't leave. Karandil. Mage trained. Scholar by inclination. Student of our Aldmeri ancestors, the Aeliads. Karandil. The secret master of transform transforming into a door. Let's let's uh... tell me more. <laughs> wait, wait, this is this would be hard mode. <laughs> um, yeah, honky tonk pancake. Um, I plan to get um. Let's see, I plan to get what is it? Um, the archaeology guild, uh, lost spires, um. I'll probably get some other ones too, but I remember Lost Spires being a fantastic mod back in the day. But that I'm definitely planning on getting that one. Oh my gosh. This would be like... Speechcraft like hard mode. You can't even see the guy's face. <laughs> Good day. She's a very private person. But I've heard... Can I help you? Hardly. Yes, I sort of know her. Well, I mean, I don't really know her, but I've talked to her some. In tears of a friend. Okay. Interesting. I'll look that up, too. <laughs> Let's see. Yes, I sort of know her. Well, I mean, I don't... Okay, so you probably need to be persuaded, right? Can't get lost off the Nexus if you're looking for it there. The patch. I have the old Lost Spires actually from like when I modded Oblivion probably close to six years ago, so I still have that old one. Um, <laughs> but that's weird that you can't get off the Nexus. That's interesting. I do have the old files though, which should work. Yes, I. S oh yeah, we have to like persuade or something. Do you like that? Okay. Don't! That's pretty- I don't talk such rot. I don't wait- What have he- A good one! Sure. I don't- Whatever you want. That's not bad. Is that enough? Yes, I- Nope. I need charm. Bye. I see you. Hello. Good day. Spells? No spells. Be seeing you. Wait. I have a charm scroll. It's you. <laughs> Screw Shot. buying a spell. I have it on me. Oh, let's see. Hit blurring gaze. Or beguiling touch. Oh, you do the exact same thing. Oh, wait. One's on target, one's on touch. I'll use the one on target, why not? I just have to get him to stay in one place, unfortunately. Just... Morning. What is it, Sarah? What's here with you? I don't want to, like... I want to have him, like, staying still for a little bit at Hi least. There. Hi there. We're all... He's doing, like, his morning rounds now. Sir. Alright, I'm doing it now. How do you do? Can I help you? Yes, I... S we'll see. What? I don't understand. <laughs> Is that not enough? Do I need like a much better illusion spell? I'm not seeking my roots. Come on now. Um, where is it? No. Shouldn't I be doing... Not start it. That's weird. Good day. Let's bribe him. Can yeah, I, help I guess you? I'll bribe him. Yes. I, I, every little bit helps. I don't know what to oh, say. There we go. <laughs> All I want is for her to care about me, to feel the same way as I do about her. But she doesn't. I try and I try, and it just doesn't matter. It makes me furious sometimes. Is that it? I've never laid a hand on her, either in anger or... 
I've never hurt her, okay? Take care. Apparently this isn't my active Greetings. quest, which is kind of weird. What's new with you? I don't suppose you could help me locate... No, no, we're not talking about that. We're talking about a recommendation. I don't understand it. Some ridiculous male thing, I suppose. He's been bothering Ardeline every day for a while now. He even stole her mage's staff. Perhaps he thinks it's amusing. I don't know. But it needs to stop. It's making her miserable. Hmm. Okay. It's more symbolic than practical, but each carries great significance to its owner. You're going to get Arteline's staff back. Take this charm scroll. With it, you should find Varon more receptive to questioning. Don't come back. Okay, cool. <laughs> so we have more. On an expedition to Akaku. Do I have a charm spell? I should probably have one. Illusion is one of the schools of magic I have. I feel like Starlight and Soothing and Touch. Not been heard from That's since. not gonna help me. A pleasure. Hello. What is it? Lunchtime and you don't sell spells anymore? You sold me spells like two hours ago. Delphin Gen. Oh, here we go. What the heck Only was quality that about? goods for sale here. What can okay, I interest so you in? We can get twelve on touch. Touch is a bit better, I think. Drawing <laughs> presents. I'm not quite there yet. Anything else I could do? No. Nope. All right. We'll go with um, beguiling touch then, just to have it on us in case we have any crazy quest like this again. Farewell. Oh, there you are. Don't you run for me. I must beguiling touch you. Eating's done, ma. How are you today? I've been better. <laughs> Even stole her, her wizard Hello, staff. What can I do for you? I know, right? What an awful All right. Person. I admit it. I took it from her. I, I don't know what I was thinking, honestly. I was trying to tell her how I feel, again, and she wouldn't even stop to talk to me. I just got so angry. I was a little ashamed afterwards, but I didn't know how to apologize or give it back. I wish I could. I'm afraid I don't have it anymore, you see. I... I sold it to a friend of mine, Saurus Aranum. So, guys out there, if you're, if you're looking to oppress a woman, um, don't steal something from her and expect to get the attention that you've stolen an item from her and then that's, she'll somehow be like, oh, you've stolen an item from me. Now I'm quite interested. That's not how it works. You steal stupid stupid man he lives in the talos plaza district of the imperial city he's the one who has ardeline staff now why would you sell it you idiot if i still had it i'd <laughs> gladly give it back you'll have to talk to soris arenum if you want it tell ardeline i'm sure. sorry sell her most valuable possession <laughs> why not it's not like you can give it back to because you feel too guilty. Wait, where do I have to go? There we go. I have to go back to Kudai? Oh, interesting. <laughs> yeah, you could just use the money he got from the staff to bribe her and raise her disposition. He obviously has no idea how women work. <laughs> Good to see you. Oh my gosh. Hello there. Any luck talking with Varen Vamori yet? It should be no trouble at all once you use that. Okay. Um, Mage of Varen Vamori should give it to you. No, no. Don't say anything. Okay. What about this? He sold it, huh? Well, this just keeps getting worse. Very well. I presume he gave you some indication of where the staff is now located. Take these and go resolve the situation. And of course, please keep this just between us. All right, cool. I'm getting very stacked. Three beguiles added. Wow. I'm selling some of those. Um. Okay. 
<laughs> oh my. I think we have to go to the Talus Plaza just so. <laughs> Yeah, really. A charm scroll in real life. Oh, it's not here? It's in the next district? Oh no, it's right here. Scroll of sex a time. Well met. What's going on with you? What is it now? They say that slavery has been abolished in Morrowind. So, don't be guiling touch, so let's just use that. Life. Good day, Stray. Uh, Major Staff. Yes, I have the staff Varen sold me. I'm afraid I'm not willing to part with it. I paid good money for it, after all. You understand, of course. You. We'll see. You rotten thing. Yeah, that, that is a weird question, honky, honky tonk pancake, yeah. You'd think an alienware would be able to handle oblivion. <laughs> oh gosh. Doesn't like that. Okay. Oh, what? You're a... I doubt... You've got a point. You've got a point. Oh, you're... Per I doubt you really mean that. You're good. Is that good enough now? As much as I like you, friend. I'm just not you. Can I stack something? Like stack another beguile on a beguile? I feel like that's too much beguiling. Oh, this is actually like a really good. Take care. Beguile. How are you? Look how he smart. As soon as I hit him with a skull, he's like, continue. "I'm so happy to see you." Look, I can't just give it to you. I paid good money for it, after all. I'll tell you what. You give me at least a portion of what I pay for it. Say, 200 gold. That's a good deal, right? I wouldn't offer it to anyone else, just you. So, what do you say? It's a deal. I'll just take the money from you, then. And here's your staff. Now, since our business is concluded, you must excuse me. Good. It better give me some sort of, like, crazy... Thing. What does their major staff do? It charms. How delightful. <laughs> that took away like a third of my funds. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> Maybe I should put rune skulls back in. <laughs> if Oblivion is just going to dick me like this all the time. Maybe I should add rune skulls back in. Good afternoon. I think I'll get compensated though. That does seem a bit odd if I'm just down 200 gold to complete a quest. How are you? Do you have? Oh, yes. Ah, wonderful. I shall be most pleased to return this to its rightful owner. Thank you. You needn't tell me the details of what was involved in getting it. It's perhaps better that I know nothing about it. Your actions for the guild more than merit a recommendation. I shall send it to the university promptly. And to thank you more personally, I shall teach you this spell. You may find it useful in certain circumstances. What spell are you going to teach me? Oh, Captivate. Okay, so it's not the other one. Hmm. Please, I'm in desperate need Hello of help, there. and- No, 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 no. We're not doing that quest. <laughs> so what spell did she teach me? Captivate. Oh! I think you're you the only word one about that Kodai's I can turn to. She's offering a generous reward. Wow. That was a horrible quest. Absolutely horrible. <laughs> That was that was awful. Um, I'm getting back those slippers. <laughs> I'll take that as my reward for that quest because that was just awful. Down 200 gold, and I learn a spell that's worse than a spell I just bought previously. No. Got 
getting back my mage slippers. I think it was this room. No, nope. it was over here. Can't quite remember. Ah, it was back here. In this room. There we go. I need some sort of reward for how often I'm just getting screwed over. There we go. Fortify Magica, Conjuration, and Drain Strength. There we go. That's better. The quest for the holy slippers and Bingrot's luck. It wasn't that much of a quest, I just sort of found it. <laughs> I knew where I put them. Apparently there's more people in this temple. It's kind of weird. <laughs> it's true, it's true. I shouldn't have dropped those slippers, they're too good. <laughs> All right, so we got my. Oh, you know what? What's funny is I was running around barefoot for the longest time, and I didn't realize it. All right, um, so we have to go to Chaden Hall, and honestly, I'm thinking we fast travel to Chaden Hall and walk back to the Imperial City. Slippers of Doom. Oh gosh, the Slippers of Doom from Morrowind. Holy crap, those were too funny. Those were awful. There was like a lady in Morwen, and she had these things called the Slippers of Doom. And, uh, gosh, it was awful. She, it's, what's funny is, she was like compelled to use the Slippers of Doom, which actually damaged health on self, and I don't know why she would even cast it. You'd think everything would be good enough that, what? How can I help you today, friend? Is there something I can... What are you wearing? Good day to you. What is that, like a two-handed silver mace of freaking glory? If I was a man who used blunt weapons, that would be mine right now. <laughs> what was I saying? Yeah. She had the Slippers of Dooms, and she actually used it. And, like, damaged herself. It was the weirdest thing. Uh, let's wait till a reasonable hour. Although I say reasonable hour, and there's still people like up at 12 a.m. Yes. Thank goodness for auto saving, right? Morwen did not have auto saving, and I sometimes would lose like how I don't know, like a half an hour sometimes. I'm Dita, magician, mages guild that is. Oh, she trains? Recommendation? I'm afraid you'll have to speak to Falkar about that. Okay. Goodbye. Where's Falkar? What is it, associate? Don't tell me you're here for a recommendation. <laughs> recommendation. Don't waste my time if you're not ready for this. Are you prepared to do what is necessary to gain a recommendation from me? <laughs> Slipper related death. I know, right? Yes, I'm right. Hmm. Very well. We shall see how prepared you actually are. There was a particular ring of burden I was testing some time ago. Another stupid associate somehow got his hands on it and managed to misplace it. If I didn't know better, I'd say he purposely tossed it down the well behind the guild hall. Why he would do such a thing is beyond me. You will retrieve this ring for me. Mm -hmm. Should you manage to do so, I shall consider sending a recommendation to the university. The well is locked, so you'll need the key. Dietzen should have a copy of it. Now get moving. Okay. Good day. Let's see what kind of spells I can get. I'm Magician Orator of the Mages Guild. I divide my time between the Chaden Hall Guild and my own private studies at Willowbank. Thanks for telling me your life story. Have a look at my wares. I'm sure there's something wow, to suit you. 
Encumbrance? Guard? You hate this quest? <laughs> yeah, I know this quest well. Uh, let's get open average lock. Um, just, you know, because we'll need one eventually. Um, Tell me more. No, all right. I offer the finest goods and lowest prices oh, in all do. Um, Yeah, my day was pretty good. Oh, okay. I guess we're up there already, so we can buy this for a reasonable price. <laughs> Little bank ain't even a bank. What a liar. I know. I always found it weird how in Skyrim, like... You'd like, there'd be a dude and he'd walk by you, and it would be like, Hi, I'm this guy. I'm the captain of the Whiterun Guard. And I'm like, would you shut up and not tell me your life story when you walk up to my face? Well met. Like, people don't do that. And if they do, I usually run and cower in fear. <laughs> Let's see. Recommendation. Don't tell me Felkar has given you the same task he gave Vidkun. Oh, dear. I'd say more, but... Well, Falkar is the ranking member here, and I don't feel comfortable talking about him. I'm sorry. I'll tell you what. Find me when Falkar's not around, and then we'll talk. After we've spoken, you can have the key. Believe me, this is important. When do I meet you? As I've said, I just don't... Okay. Well I... met. I'm Trayvon, the Red Guard. Mage's Guild Evoker. Surprised? Yes, you don't see many Red Guards in the Mage's Guild. We don't much like spellcasters in Hammerfell. Wizards steal souls and tamper with minds. If you use magic, you're weak or wicked. My family didn't approve of my vocation, so I had to come to Cyrodiil for my education. I admit, I still have strong prejudices against necromancy, summoning, and illusion. Profaning the remains or souls of the dead is just wrong, and I'm uneasy about tampering with others' minds and trafficking with Deidre. Wow. Have a look around. What you a won't find better prices Those are all my all favorite Tamriel. things to do. <laughs> um, sure, let's get water walking and water breathing. We don't have those. Oh, you know what? We'll, uh, we'll not do that for now. My gold's very low. I am my ketchup from the top pallet town. I'm gonna be a Pokemon master. <laughs> Phantom, you're so right. You're so right. Uh, Loading Sundu, my favorite um, style of play is, or for any sort of RPG, is an armored spellcaster. Um, and more do? specifically, I usually like to play one that uses Warhammers. So, yeah. I know that that dude. All right, <laughs> I know, right? He had to really rant. He really. I was just. I was just wondering, like, if he'd sell me a spell. But there we go. They tell me their life story. <laughs> Image of talents. Um, how long do I have to wait? Or will the journal tell me? Let's see. Someone cast a nasty spell. What are you doing? Don't mess up the floorboards. I hope I can help. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what are your stats? Okay, she's probably a spellcaster. High elf mage. Magic. Okay, probably probably not. I need someone that's more beefy. Oh, call me Sundu. Okay, Sundu. Seriously? <laughs> She's just going mental. I mean, technically, right? That's how you actually, like, practice your spells. When I was younger, the way I used to do it is I would get one spell right, and um, basically what I would do is I had, like, a rock and a vice grip, and I would set the, the rock, it was like an oval-shaped rock on a vice grip, and I would just lean it on my keyboard, and it was enough to just on the C key and there you go 
That's how you train magic in, in oblivion. <laughs> Yeah, stealth with magic is pretty awesome too. Okay, let me check what hour I have to. Let's see. I need the key to Jaden all. Okay. Alright, let me wait like. Pfft, six hours? See where that gets us? <laughs> I know, you're just getting a cup of coffee and there's like people using spells. Like, it's getting I'm nasty Dita, in here. Magician. Recommendation. We can talk. So long as Falcaris, he gave poor Vidkin the okay. same task, and we never saw him again. I'm reasonably sure there's a connection, but I can't prove it. Do be careful. I'd hate to lose another useful associate. Here's the key, and something extra. I don't know if it will be of use to you, but from what I've heard of Falcar's ring, it may come in handy. And if you find out anything about what happened to Vidkun, let me know, will you? Okay, cool. Oh, she gave me water reading. Sweet, I didn't have to buy it. <laughs> you put a rubber band on your 360 controller. Yeah. Well, actually, one of my uh, one of my favorite um, things um, in Oblivion is there's um, there's one quest uh, where there's like a haunted house in Anvil, and the guy right is actually scripted. That like. He leaves and goes all the way to the Imperial City. So what you can do is you can sneak behind him the entire time. Like the entire time. And then you complete the quest. And he walks all the way back to Anvil. You basically like if you if you actually like had the stick to itiveness to actually do that twice, your sneak is like raised by forty. It's ridiculous. And the Ring of Burden, which is 150 pounds. Uh, one thing I can do is I do have a new spell. I don't know if it's going to help me. It's Burden. Not that much. Nope. Um, oh gosh. I'm going to drop a lot of stuff in this water. Um, I can unequip my slippers get a little bit of strength back and what like drop another bow yeah that did it there we go have the ring of burden and return to Falcar I'll come back for that stuff later <laughs> greetings have oh no way that's pretty funny well, I know, I think it's a thing where you can just, like, do? keep walking into a no, wall, no, no, no. right? And that counts. I'm afraid some things have happened while you've been gone, Associate. It may affect your recommendation. Oh, really? I'll admit, it's my doing. I couldn't leave well enough alone. And after you'd left to go after that ring, well... I'm just so tired of the way we've all been treated by Falkar. I was worried about you and angry about Vidkund, so I confronted Falkar directly. He was furious when I told him I'd helped you, and then when I threatened to report him to the Council of Magus, I thought he was going to kill me. He flew into a rage. I didn't even understand some of his ranting, but he said that our days are numbered, and then he stormed out. I don't know if he ever wrote your recommendation. I'm sorry. I didn't expect this to happen. Perhaps you should go look and see if he did write one. You should check his room in the living quarters. If you see the note or anything else unusual, let me know. I'll gladly send it to the council. Okay, cool. So let's head up to his room. Be seeing you. So long. Oh, was it upstairs or Good no, to see downstairs? You. It's weird, my camera's very high up, like, you'd think I'd be, like, earth, like, hitting the... Well, actually, technically, my, my mohawk is just brushing the, the doorway. All this in a minute. Okay. 
He's got potion of feather. Fantastic. Parchment. Nope. Shell. Nope. Peel city. Nope. Drawers. Nope. Chest. Nope. Drawers. Level lock easy. Well then. Black soul gems. Ooh. Mine. Keep them if I can. What are these potions? Ooh, potions of magicka. Crap. How am I over encumbered? That doesn't make any sense. Wait, I still have the ring of burden. <laughs> Here, wait. I think, uh. Oh gosh. <laughs> uh, let me drop this ring of burden. I don't think I need it anymore. Can I pick it up? I can. Whee! I'll just put it on the table. <laughs> I cut the doorway with my hair, yeah. What's this? Black soul gems? They're mine. Can oh dear, them. this is worse than I'd expected. All right, I'll just take these from you. I'll need them for my report to the council. Uh, now, you didn't find any sort of recommendation? Very well. I shall write one myself and include it in my report to the council. In light of the circumstances, I believe they'll find it more than adequate. You stole my black soul gems. Okay. Hooray, I've completed all the guild quest hall things. Woo! Um. Is that all I needed? Oh, I have a push and water breathing. I was wondering why I, or, no, um, uh, what is it called? This nerve room. I have a necklace of water breathing, so I don't care. <laughs> Forgot about that. Um, let's put my wizard slippers back on. Um, let's see what else. I still don't know which bow's better, unfortunately. So we'll just stick with them. Um... Do I not have it equipped? We'll steal long bow. I reset it. Okay. Uh oh. There we go. You know what's pretty funny? I think the computer that I'm using to run this was actually a computer like I like I built at the time, like when Oblivion was out. And it was really funny because Oblivion at the time, right? It's um Gosh, you have to wait like 12, 13, 14 hours. At the time, Oblivion, um, like, the thing that would take up the most, like, like, graphics, I'm not exactly sure how you'd say this, but like, the most intense, like, graphical thing was the Oblivion Gates themselves, which is pretty interesting. Like, when it first came out, that was like, if your computer could handle that, that was like a test of fortitude for your computer. Borba Grauzgash. We've got everything the adventurer needs. I'm an old adventurer myself, and I know what's wanted. Okay. What? Oh gosh, she like kinda hates me. Um She likes that. Isn't a fan of that. Kinda likes that, and doesn't like that. Sorry. What a great Yes! Don't talk such rot. What a... Don't talk... I accept... What a dumb joke. Oh crap, I did that wrong. So wait, you don't like that. You like this. Okay, never mind. I what did that a wrong. What a... Don't waste your... No more! You're frightening me. Hmm. Really? Interesting. I accept. Not now? You think that's funny? No, it's because I'm an Ultimer. 
and like basically everybody hates Ultimers except Ultimers. <laughs> like it's really wild. What nonsense! I accept. What a gr you think that's funny? I wish I could say that. She doesn't like jokes. What a whatever. Not now. Not later. Not ever. Well, no, it's it, yeah, it's it's pretty wild actually. The um, I know, like for some time, like sometimes it's like really difficult Sorry. to tell like the beast well races like how they feel with speechcraft. Don't, don't waste really your flattery weird. on me. All right. That's not bad. All right, let's charm her too, so we you. get a good price. Well, actually, what do you want? What Only do you even quality accept? goods for sale here. Okay, so you do what accept weird stuff. You in? Oh, you'll even accept uh, base necklaces of the sea. Oh, but you'll give me a terrible price, though. Holy crap! It's a terrible price. Oh, hey. Is that Dangbro sixty nine? <laughs> DH. DHG bro 69. Oh, thanks for follow DH bro 69. <laughs> you know loading or you know Sundu? I'm actually not sure um, if a 2.1 gigahertz quad core processor. I'd think that sounds impressive, <laughs> but honestly, like, I have no idea. <laughs> I honestly have no idea. I think the I think wikis will give you minimum requirements though. Oh no, it, no that's fine, D, um, DHG bro sixty nine. That's fine. It's all fine. Um, let's see. Let's sell a dwarven shield maybe. You got Ooh, to be. Nope, she's not pleased. How about how about this? Clear up our inventory just a little bit. Um. Oh, I could sell. What is it? I could sell those, I guess. Oh, hey, Thane of Tamriel. How's it going? Um, uh, let's see. Let's keep some of these. There was one. Here's the, the boat. The, That's a good deal. The tone boots. Farthest stones are worth a lot. I think this lady's ripping me off, though, unfortunately. So, I'll stop at that. I'll keep both of these bows, because I'm not sure which one's better. Come I'll have back to be better at Marksman before I can tell. Bye. Oh, cool. <laughs> cool DHG, bro. Yeah, I know. It's it's exciting the first time you get followers when you're streaming. It, it, you, <laughs> it's really cool. Alright. So let's head out then. I think I'm all ready to go. My magic is like super. Um, I'm really close to leveling up too, which is nice. Hmm. But you know, before we go, is there anyone beefy people? Um, the fire. I'm hoping for like um. Actually, now that you mention it, like I'm just going back to check ins and stuff like that. Um, the kind of partner that I'm looking for, right, to help me on my adventures, How can I help is you today, some friend? sort of knight blade. Hey, yes? So, who has some sort of armor, right? Uh, and, um, let's see. You're a dark elf. Assassin. Okay, we can check your magic skills. It's more in stealth, though. Yeah, he doesn't really have very much, um... He has alchemy and destruction, but nah. Hmm. You know, I'll have to check it out, Thane of Tamriel. Um, I have it listed on mods I want to add, so. Uh, you've been here. I'm looking for new people. How can I help you today, friend? Yeah, actually, it's weird. Um, oh, cool. Uh, cool DHG, bro. Awesome. 
Uh, so that was one in. We can try this in as well. Apparently they're like dotted around inns and stuff. All right, cool thing, with Tamriel. Hello. Well, you're not wearing armor, so no. <laughs> hmm. I know some some Twitch streamers are kind of touchy when it comes to other people saying that they're streamers and you know Twitch. You know, honestly, honestly, it's okay. <laughs> We're all here to have a good time, play games, and, you know, have awesome people watch us. So, that's that's basically the main reason why. I have heard of the Better Cities mod, but I've seen it played on someone else's um, stream. And, um, gosh, did they have terrible voice acting. <laughs> and I don't think I can bear it, to be honest. Um... Yes, we actually, um, I added, um, a CM Partners mod, um, so I do actually have, um, companions, um, I don't have one with me right now, but we will eventually. I'm trying to look for some sort of Nightblade or something. Something that attacks people right away, you know, that doesn't use Marksman at all. I think he's not a fan of me. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh, sorry. I hit my fire each mark. Ow. If you'd attack the person behind you, that would actually be a lot more effective. Maybe... What do you think? I think he's attacking me with his arrows. Oh gosh. Ah! Sweet! I can level up. I'll take both of those. Lock picks, why not? He's peppered with those. Oh gosh! The ice pick! <laughs> sure, I'll take that. I'll take Leather Greaves, why not? Let me uh, heal myself a bit. It's weird, I haven't even gone that far. I feel like I should go back and like rest at the inn or something. Well. Oh, how do I drop items? Um, go to your inventory and you would go do... Um, I do shift click, but there might be other buttons. Is right click a button that you do? I do shift click. And it falls on the ground. Ice pick's just a really funny weapon, though. I'm not sure if there's um if there's different ways to do it, but that's the way I do it. Apparently, there's some sort of cave. Check it out later, though. Oh, you can drag them out of the window. Huh. Do 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 do. Basically, I'm just exploring right now. <laughs> I kind of like exploring the roads to see what's there, but... Oh, dra <laughs> dragging and dropping. I gotcha. What is it, citizen? I really should kind of explore a little bit more for, um... There's like some sort of like hamlet here or something. Or just a single house. <laughs> some person's cabin. Apparently can't go in it. I should really be collecting more alchemy items, but I'm just seeing them off the road. Storing magic is a problem for my character. Let me see. Which 
I should use one right now. Store edge guy. I know the exploration music is so yeah. Ooh, that guy. Assuming that he is a bandit. I hope he's a bandit. I'll save that for a warrior. Did I quick save? Let me quick save first. <laughs> Are you a dark elf? I don't think that he is. reason I've been fighting a lot of um, dark elf archers and fireballs like you know not that great on them oh, got him what is this classic bow and curvy Chris dagger interesting This stone cup, tan jug. It's like a broken down house. Where? <laughs> oh god. So what is this classic? See, I have no idea which one's better, because this one's. It, they're all four damage, all these bows. The steel bow, the worn bow, and the classic bow. Classic bow looks very classic though, doesn't it? Yes, it's very classic. I like the steel bow better. But we'll have to see once my marksman gets better which one is uh, actually more effective. <laughs> Pick up a jug. <laughs> you murdered someone having a picnic. That, that might be true. Hmm. I don't feel bad about it for some reason, though. That's worrying. <laughs> Ragnagor, murder of picnic goers. Alright, since we're here, right, let's just, let's just head in, right? It's time to, oh gosh, I really don't have a lot of gold. It's where he came. Alright, let's get in this place. Since I've been trying to do it forever. Hello, Master Wit. Hello, Associate. It seems you've obtained the final recommendation you required. Recommendation! I have received recommendations from all the local guild halls in Cyrodiil. You've done well for yourself. You may now enter the university. As a full-fledged member of the Mage's Guild, I now also promote you to the rank of Apprentice and grant you the robe of the Apprentice. Take a moment and try it on. Then we shall speak of what comes next for you. Well, robe of the Apprentice. Is that actually good for me? Fortify willpower. And no, I can't wear my, my enchanted... Fire pants. So no. Oh, Matt. <laughs> what is a mod you recommend? Um, mods that I currently have that I recommend. Um, that's a difficult one to say, really. I'll have to get back to you on that. Um, DHG, bro. There's there's a lot that I have currently. Um. But there is a quest mod called um, called Lost Spires, and that's a fantastic mod. Hello. Um, there's also a few good um, like house mods that you can get. But if you're I, one spell mod that I have right now is Midas Magic, and once you actually get the required ingredients, you make some fantastic spells. It's Hi. fantastic. Like like really good like graphics and everything for the spells too. Quarters. Practice 
just rooms. Might be in here. Good afternoon. Is there's an altar of enchanting? Altar of enchanting. Mysticism increased. Interesting. Is this, oh, that's all enchanting. Actually, it's really funny, Elder James. I don't have any of those patch mods. Greetings, um, apprentice. I do have them downloaded, but I don't have them like part of the game. Yet. Greetings, apprentice. So far, I have not had an issue, but uh, I'm pretty sure I will. <laughs> Just grabbing some flax, because that's good for um, potions. Stinkhorn's good for magic. I don't see anything offhand, though. This place? Where's the place where you make your spells? Check on that. I'm confused. Is it one of these ones? Mystic Archives, Mage Quarters, Imperial Watchtower, Lustridorium, Chronosan. Chirognasium? Chirognasium? Nice magic spells. Chirony. Maybe it's over this way. How goes it? Oh yeah, true. I should probably get that one. Yeah, that that actually like you know like cuts down the stalks and stuff like Hello that. There. This is what I've been waiting for forever. The ability to make spells. Alright. Now, I only have 300 gold, unfortunately. Um, this makes things difficult. In fact, I'm pretty sure I cannot do anything about it. Yeah, I, I should probably have those um, unofficial um, patches. Oh gosh. <laughs> Dane of Tamriel, I'm not exactly sure that's the best Skyrim mod, but it is pretty sweet. It turns all dragons into Macho Man Randy Savage. It's pretty good. Um, gosh, let me head to um, the Market District, sell a few things, and then see what I can do. Let's go to the Merchants Inn and see if there's any um, companions there that are hopefully like battle magey or something. Basement? No. Okay, Thin of Tamriel. <laughs> see you later. Alright. It's really funny in this game, I always find that, like, if there's a coffee table, I've kicked something off of it. It's my pleasure. Yeah. May I interest you in some of my fine wares? I've got this, and this. You've made a good bit of gold. And all these. Let's see. You drive a oh, hard please, bargain. Come back and see me again. Hey, Lupus and Plan. Let's see. She wouldn't buy the rope of the apprentice. Oh, I can level up. Let's go to my tower. How come how come I can never like teleport to the front door? Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Face of yeah, lupus and fabulous. I, I it it makes no sense. 
there was literally like a woman and she was turned around and like she had like the most horrible like face you could ever imagine like it was terrible I think what I said verbatim was oh you need some face cream <laughs> Oh, is it? Oh my gosh, what did... You know, I think it's different environments um, have different lighting, unfortunately. So let me try this. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know why my lighting changes, but it does. <laughs> yeah, unmodded Oblivion is, is interesting. That's why I've modded it. <laughs> but unfortunately, the faces aren't, uh, aren't quite fixed yet. Alright, let's put a few things away, shall we? Um, I need to sell those. Those would be really good to sell. And apparently the Robe of the Apprentice is no gold, so I'm putting it away. Um, let's level up. Really, you think Frost Spells are the most effective? I really don't know, like, what has, like, what spells the least resistances to it. It'd be interesting to know, though. We'll go for intelligence, more agility, and we'll do more endurance because I definitely need more health and um, more fatigue. There we go. Sweet. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to drop these bows on the... No, I'll put them in the chest. Because... They could be better than the bow I currently have, but I have no idea. So I'll just put both of those back. And repair a bit. There we go. Oh, that's true, because it slows down enemies, yeah. What is- are there secondary- I mean, it, it does for, um... Wait, do you mean that- that- Blizzard has that secondary effect in Oblivion. I don't quite remember that, but that could be a thing. I don't remember it though offhand though. All right, let's go to the uh, market district again. Let's see if I can sell these uh, rings. I've gone way too far down. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, the area of effect frost spell is pretty wild because it. Uh, in, I think it has the lowest uh, frost spells in Oblivion. Have the lowest like. Um, like distance that they can go but when you shoot it it actually is a giant cloud that just goes forward which is pretty awesome so it like hits everything in its path um, as opposed to fireballs which is just you know a centralized explosion and I think lightning yeah, is here, sort of so. chained I believe like it hits one guy and it hits people near it I think it's been a while Plus, my character's not that great at um, destruction yet. He's alright, but we don't have too many spells that we work with. Alright, let's wait till morning. Yeah, six hours. Hmm. Fine elegance. Alright. What can I do for you? Only you... quality goods for sale. Well, she has she has a decent what amount can of gold. Alright. Um, how about haggling? Can I get let's see, um Take your time. Let's get as much as we can Take out of her, right? Um good guy. Well met. Need new clothing? I have a fantastic supply. Bring this up a bit more. I don't know how much we can get away with, but we can try. Um, wow, we can sell our base necklaces of the sea. Interesting. Um, let's sell the base ring of sneak. Make me a better offer. No, okay, never mind. I'll try that. An excellent Ooh, bargain. Ooh, let's do this. Oh yes. That seems a fair. What price. a cash injection! Holy crap! <laughs> oh man, that's fantastic. Thank you for your patronage. Oh. Bye. 
That was great. I mean, screw it. I have a spell now that does, uh, I think I have a spell that uh, lets me breathe underwater. Sweet. Hmm. Oh, interesting. Huh. Alright, well now we have some, um, we actually have some money to work with, so let's actually make a destruction spell. I was a little worried that, that the game crashed. It sort of went too quickly. Is there just a... You, sir, have really yellow hair. Fortunately, my hangover is making it difficult to think straight. You're best off speaking to Gilbert for now. Well, Gary Wallace is a nice guy, but, um... <laughs> yes? Master Spellmaker Gaspar Stegin at your service. New spells, old spells, good spells, bad spells. They're all fun for me. Hmm. Interesting. May I interest you in some so. of my fine wares? Ooh, disintegrate weapon. Legendary detect life, shadow, silence. Summon faded wraith, spider daedra. Ooh, and spell absorption. Sweet. This guy is like, hmm. Take care. Oh my gosh. Hello there. All right, let's see how if we can do this. I want to make a lightning spell. So shock damage. On target. I want it like two seconds. No area of effect. I think that'll be fine. Um, but I also want to incorporate. Yeah, those spells are way out of my league, yeah. Um, I also want to, like, absorb health or something. I think that'd be really cool if I can do that. So it costs 14. Absorb health. Why is this a magnitude and duration? Oh, does, wait, does absorb health only work? When, um, when you're close, you can't do it while you're far away. I think that's a thing. I kind of remember, like, there was, like, there when you shoot people, there's, like, a really weird, um, like, bolt, basically. Hmm. Maybe absorb spell doesn't work. Let me know. Um, because that doesn't seem to have... Yeah, it only works on touch. Yeah, that's what I thought. Which would be dangerous for my character. Uh, because I don't do any melee. Um... Alright, well instead, let's do some something weird. Something that I did with my old character, which is have like a restore health spell and a destruction spell wrapped up in one. <laughs> which is wild. Um, but here we go. I restore five of my health and damage ten of theirs. It's only 21, so I could maybe do a bit more. Let me check something. For reference, what does a Greek Fireball cost 9? Flare costs 8. Cold Touch costs 18. Interesting. Alright. Now another question, right? If I add Restore health. Will it count to raise both of my, uh, like, of, of both um, destruction and restoration, or will it only count for, like, the one with the highest magnitude? Because um, that used to be a thing in Morrowind, so I'm, ex I'm not exactly sure. Does anybody know? That'd be an intense spell. That'd be 20, 20 points. I restore health. Um, requires destruction at 25. That's cool. Hmm. I don't know, though, if it's going to be, like, destruction-based or restoration-based, unfortunately. Hmm. Does anybody know offhand? I have a feeling... Or at least this is the way it worked in Morrowind. That you kind of have to have, um... 
one of them be a higher magnitude than the other, and then that counts. So technically, like a spell like this would actually raise my, uh, test it after you use on that guy. That's true. So this actually requires the destruction of 25, so it might only do destruction. So let's do this. This will do like 18 damage and restore my health. And since we're kind of just testing it. Oh, actually, Jadis, you might be onto something there. So let's try that. So we have Restoration first, and then try using Lightning. That requires a destruction of 50. Which I don't have. That's very interesting. That requires the destruction of 25. This is very strange. So let's just delete that. That is. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't mess with it. <laughs> Maybe that's what I should do. Uh, let's see what I can get away with. I can go 13 for two seconds on target. Interesting. Let's bring it back down to 10. I kind of like the idea of 10. Restore health on self. I mean, let's, let's just test this out, right? I'll bring it down one magnitude just to see if it works. Alright, and I'll just... There we go. <laughs> Since I quick saved. Um, so this will be called that crazy thing I just made. There we go. <laughs> Waf Nezak slash Iljida. Well, that's a pretty wild effect. Look, I got like lightning all over me. Um, here, wait. Let me, um, let's take a look at. So I have my destruction and restoration. It's too bad it's not like a number, otherwise I'd be able to see like the progress. Um, I did save, so we're good here. Okay, so restoration's like about middle, and destruction's like about uh, who knows. Oh, you know what? Destruction doesn't raise unless you hit somebody. I forgot about that. Take that! I think my restoration is actually raising. Let me try to keep my mouse in a central place. Don't feel bad. No one lives forever. Hmm, I'm not sure if it's raising it. Weird. I'm not exactly sure. You know what? Let's just make a cool destruction spell, right? We won't get complicated until later, but I, I needed a cool shock on the target spell. So the duration of two seconds. Let's make it like 15. Nah, we'll make it 10. Cost is a bit too high for me right now. Alright. I'll call this. Hmm. Hmm. Not sure. Cult voltage. Hmm. Yeah, it's weird. We'll have to I'll have to do some research to see what, what actually happens when you combine spells like that. Call it. Sweet. So now I can replace that five voltage. Now, unfortunately, it costs a ton compared to like like um, 
weak fireball. Which does 15, this does 20. I mean, that's a pretty severe difference. But I think that's because weak fireballs like given to you and not actually made, unfortunately, so we'll have to deal with that. Alright, so I think we're good to go for let's see. Well, we have to head to Kavach. Um so I guess we're gonna have to run there, right? Or something. Let's go to the stables. I was a. Oh no, wait. Maybe I'm not famous enough. There's these weird things, like, called Doom Stones, I think. And, like, for some reason, like, if I go up to it, it'll, um. It has, like, some sort of crazy effect, and I don't remember what it is. But, uh. But, yeah. We'll have to, uh, check it out one day. I think it gives you, like, some sort of, like, permanent effect, almost like the, um. The, uh. What? The Birth Stones, or. The, are they called Doom Stones? I forget. In Skyrim, there's different things. Yeah. Oh gosh! <laughs> um. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, of course I run out of magic, right? <laughs> um. Wait. <laughs> Yeah, I know, there's there's certain things, like restoration only trains if you're hurt, and different things like that, so that might be an issue. I'll take those. Uh-oh. Can it actually get to me? That's a question. Let me just put a shield on. I think I think my flame mate Chinaki killed that dog. Well there's there's the um there's the Doom Stones, and then there's another stone. Like, one's blue and one's red, and I don't remember which ones do what. There's a Way Shrine over there, so we'll get to that. More flax, that's good for uh, restoration magic. Oh, tep- okay. Alright, right, sweet. I absorbed most of that. More flax. Let's get back on the road. There's an alien well, too, wow. Oh, okay. More flex. More. <laughs> I think I have like 30, oh gosh. That's awesome. It actually floored him. And like knocked him over. That's pretty cool. I just need a good like target spell. <laughs> 